What we have planned today is a uh, technology update on where we're at with SaaS. So I'm gonna first of all start off with SaaS Viet. So over six and a half years ago, we started on a journey of building out a high performance architecture to solve a high performance risk problem that was presented to us by a customer. That architecture has been used by uh, many of our customers to solve some of their problems that require very fast processing in memory types of operations. Now, about five years ago, with the rise of big data technologies, in particular around Hadoop, one of the things that um, we decided to tackle was this ability to rapidly work on you know, billions of records, gigabytes or terabytes of data, but do so in a manner that didn't require you to lift stuff off of disk repeatedly in order to facilitate better performance of your analytic calculations, all with an eye towards making sure that things run in an acceptable fashion, regardless of the scale. So we developed our in-memory analytics server that many of you are familiar with, which we call Laser which backstops our visual analytics um, application in particular. Now, these two different architectures solve different problems, but one of the pieces of feedback we got from our customers was, it's great that you have two different architectures, but why can't, we, why can't it just be one? And so about three and a half years ago, uh, Dr. Goodnight instructed our R&D team to say, let's um, address our customer needs to unify these two environments while at the same time building upon what we've learned about the right way to do this and see what we can do to improve it. So that's where we started with our third generation massively parallel architecture that is the engine behind SAS VIA. SAS VIA it can be said to be our new modern cloud ready platform. And that platform is exemplified by four pillars. It's unified, it's open, it's powerful and it's cloud ready. From a unified perspective, one of the th reasons why customers have consistently come to SaaS in the past is that they know that regardless of the analytics problem, regardless of the scenario, regardless of um, where, what it is they're trying to do, they know that they're going to get consistent analytics and we're taking that forward into this realm. We're not leaving it behind. It's a big differentiator for us relative to many of the alternatives that exist in the market. Now the open piece is something you're gonna hear us talk quite a lot about. This is probably the biggest change that you're gonna see SaaS talking about um, from its 40 year history. And we're going to demonstrate as part of what we do, Wayne is going to show you just how far we have come in, uh, in embracing this open approach. The powerful piece is something that customers have always expected from SaaS. We solve the hardest problems on the edge cases that the other guys can't. So we're going to continue to do that, but we're gonna overlay an element of simplicity here from the perspective of putting that power into customers' hands easier than ever. It's one thing to do something very, very well and to, to solve and, and address hard problems. It's another thing to make it so easy to do that customers can do it from a self-service type of perspective. And that's a one that we hope to have um, for us uh, as part of VIA. And then on the cloud front, and I'll talk quite a bit about this, the cloud piece is probably the most visible aspect and the thing that I think most people have glommed onto in terms of understanding what's different about VIA as a platform relative to our existing platform. It's an element of not just technology delivery, but it's also business delivery. So it's one thing to make products that can run and be ready for deployment in a cloud type of environment. It's quite another to deliver business models that facilitate their use in that environment. And that's something that we're doing as well. You can run a calculation that has part of the data in memory and part of the data on disk. We're breaking things apart and turning it into a loosely coupled architecture. CAS can recognize the location of your data and make an implicit a processing choice on where to run the calculation. We're expanding this to provide open interfaces for Python, Java, and Lua. We're going to be deploying our software as services on top of Cloud Foundry. We can meet your IT needs, whatever they are. If you take away nothing about VIA from this presentation, it is one open analytics platform for all. Deployments can be done in minutes as opposed to hours or sometimes even days. Customers are going to be running 9.4 and VIA side by side for a period of time. It is worth noting that they can both run on the same hardware. But by, by the way, this is what we do at SaaS. We make software to solve business problems for people. 